I got to see him, I think, maybe about 13, 14 years ago and had him on the show many times. What is his name again, Gary? Yeah, Anthony J. Hilder. What a brilliant guy and funny. And, of course, I, I you know, he had a lot of pretty high profile in Hollywood, too. Um, he could actually take a story that would make you vomit or upset and make you laugh at the same time you're crying, which is what I try to do sometimes when I take really ugly things. Like uh, Adam Schiff, I've changed the last two F's in his name to T, because that's what he's full of. I mean, this man needs to be locked up in a psychiatric facility. He should be removed, as the uh, uh, the House Minority Leader has said, from this so-called witch hunt called, uh, now we'll call it Ukrainagate, I guess what I call it, Ukrainagate, and the foolishness that's going on. And we got the poppy-eyed, too much plastic surgery, uh, Nancy Pelosi, you know what? She can scratch her right butt cheek by just scratching her right cheek because she's in some damn much plastic surgery. But the woman is imbalanced. She starts her for talk about trying to uh, work with Donald Trump. You know, we're going to work on really lowering the prices of drugs. Trump's already done that. We're going to work with infrastructure. Well, Trump has an agenda of infrastructure. They don't want to work. They just want power. And they don't care if it kills the American economy or kills people destroys their finances, or causes industry to leave, or makes our enemies more likely to bomb us or hit our power grid. She doesn't give a crap, because the woman's a witch. She's crazy. And we're going to go over a little autopsy. I can see a few of your articles you sent me. One on Adam Schiff's Standard Hotel, West Hollywood, Ed Buck's Dead Bodies, Secret Societies, and then you have another one, Andre Balzas, B-A-L-A-Z-S, Standard Hotel. I'd like you to start. Which topic would you like to touch first? Do you want to start off with Adam Schiff? I think it's the first uh, batch of articles and pictures you sent me, which you, you, a word is worse. Uh, is, is a, a word is one thing, but a, a picture is worth more than a thousand words sometimes, isn't it? Yeah. No, we've we've got him uh, right alongside. Uh, I think we have to look at the uh, uh, most recent person that. Uh, has actually been snagged, uh, one of the ones that has been uh, drugging male uh, prostitutes and having them die at his, uh, at his uh, uh, residence. And this is, uh, you know, these are only the times that we know that it's happened and that he has spent uh, uh, much of his money in uh, campaigning for the district attorney of Los Angeles. And, uh, boy, you're... you're <laughs> I wish Dr. Anthony Sutton was alive. Wait till we you're, you're, you're start referring talking. To, you're not referring to Schiff, are you? Or are you referring to Epstein? Uh, well, I'll, I'll be, yeah, I'm referring to, uh, uh, I'll be talking about Andre. No, uh, I know who Ballad. is this you're referring to that put you his money. Is this Epstein or Schiff? I'm sorry, I didn't. I who didn't used their money to support the Attorney General of L.A.? Yeah. Uh, Epstein or Schiff? Right. Yeah, no, this is Ed Bach responsible for these these oh, Bach, murders okay. and and. Are you talking uh, about Ed Bach? Okay, good. Yeah, right. No, and, I, and, I, and, and not you'll connect him, that later also, back to you connect that later back to the other pedophilia maniacs, and you have to understand these are demonic astral sacrifices. That's why even if you are want women to control their pregnancy and have no problem with that, put a valve in, a little valve that you turn on and off, you can never get pregnant or PID. But guess what? They want to kill babies because of astral, demonic, human sacrifice. Well, we've got the uh, the Democratic uh, uh, Gay uh, Club. It's called St- uh, Stonewall Democratic Club, and uh, some of the federal officers. Um, well, I guess it's bigger than. Uh, well, these are just listing the California ones, but it includes right. a- Adam Schiff. It in- includes. Ted Lou, who's also on the Intelligence Committee, which is really, uh, uh, really outrageous. And, and, and then we have a small well that comes from a secret society, and secret societies are going to come into this more and more. So, so uh, you see, all three of these characters are Californians. Yeah, are all involved in this sexual perversion club inside the Democrats. And um, right. it, tur- it, it turns out is, is that, that a yes? Is that a yes? Well, I'm having a hard time hearing. Is that it, turn, turn up the volume, of Tomas, because he can't Let me hear see me. If I, I got to take this thing off here. Uh, do you have your headphones on? Do you have your headphones on? Yeah. Okay. Uh, are you all set? 
We need to get you technically up to speed here, Gary, and we'll help you with uh, Tomas putting out the volume to your headphones. But you have to have headphones. You can't just have a speaker phone or a little earbud. Okay. Yeah, let's talk a little bit more and see if we're getting higher. Okay, can you hear me now? I need a new headphone. Yeah, can you hear me now? Gary. I heard a click sound that was not a good sound. It sounded yeah. like you might have been. Are you, are you there, Gary? I can hear your mumbling. No, or can you hear me? Okay, I got you now. Now can you hear me? Okay. Now I, I can hear I, you. I need to be able to ask you questions and insert comments like, <laughs> okay. yes, all three of these perverts are in the Democratic Party or in this Democratic club, right? Right. Yeah. No, oh they're, they're running the intelligence and the scams and these uh, false right. flags. And, of course, Hollywood is... is literally known for that because they you know they 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 bring us romance and uh action movies and war and and you know what the origins of the word hollywood is what is a hollywood um i don't know is that something the witches use for uh, yeah you're very close ceremony oh yes it is now the holly plant the berries are used as a substitute for blood in a sacrifice you don't have blood you can make holly holly berries but the hollywood actually is called a pindar which means a penis, because the wand of a wizard is always a proxy of a demonic penis of an incubi or succubi, sexual warrior demons. Did you know that? No. Uh, yeah. See, Dr. Diggle doesn't know some of it. Dr. Diggle knows. I don't know all the details of all the connections. You're getting feedback there that's actually coming through in your answer. You want to stop that? Yeah. Okay. I don't know yeah. Uh, Turn off your speaker. You should only have a headphone set on. No speaker on. Can you, are you good now? Yeah, I have a hard time hearing you, though. But I can only have it when you're on a, if you have to have a headphone set plugged into your computer, you cannot have speakers on and we'll get feedback. I'm trying to get you up to tech speed here. Anyway, the point is that when you ask me a question, I don't know all the details you are. You're an expert in all the details of connecting the dots. But the overall expanse of what's going on, Dr. Diggle fully understands it. I'm trying to get through to the people because they just think they're dealing with greedy or self-centered people. No, you're not. You're dealing with demonically energized people that are avatar by transdimensional and exoplanetary entities. When we see them now, for example, in Tucker Carlson, they're saying, hey, we believe UFOs are real. It's just not, it's not just unidentified flying objects. It's unidentified fiendish objects. They're even avataring inside our world leaders. They are not normal humans. They're people of clay and iron. That's why my ministry is called Clay and Iron Ministries. People don't want to know it. Tough. This is your world. You got to face it if you're going to survive in it. If you live in Bangladesh and you don't believe in tigers, you're probably going to be dinner for one of the tigers. I don't want you to be dinner for the demonic entities that are running our world. Some people are even targeted individuals, and I know how to untarget them by using prayer and radionic technologies, etc., that can amplify prayer billions of times. But you have to understand, if you don't understand the reality of the nature of your world, you're going to be a victim, whether you're going to you know, a, a, a special school, it turns out there's tons of secret orders in it, like Harvard, or you're trying to join a political party and you realize a lot of them are in the secret order, or even a police or military organization that's got tons of masons. If you don't understand the Masonic control of medicine, law, politics, police, whatever, you're an idiot, and you're going to suffer for it, aren't you? Right? And you're not an idiot. Does that make sense? Yeah. So, Gary, I'd like you to continue on this. Now I hope your audio is a little bit better. And we need to get you to get a tech person in there to make sure, number one, you don't have crunch crunch sounds like this. And number two, you don't have feedback. And number three, you can hear me when I have to insert a comment because I went on a rant primarily because your audio is so bad. <laughs> so you got to get it fixed. Yeah. No, uh, I'll, I'll just have to purchase a new one for this one. Yeah, you purchase a new it's one with a headphone set awkward. that doesn't have... It does not have a uh, an audio that comes through your speaker. Okay, so you uh, have that. We're talking about you know Los Angeles being the, the megaphone for the world or the you know the the evil people, and the LA. Well, Times, that's that's the actual the coven that Hillary Clinton belonged to, and remember, I can actually name the incubi in their specific uh, demonic, demonic names. I can actually name them with the incubi that's inside Hillary Clinton. She had her coven is in Los Angeles. And L.A. is one of the centers of this thing, and of course it's heading for a great big earthquake because they're not protected against earthquakes in L.A. Um, so please continue, okay? Yeah, 
Uh, well, the Los Angeles Times, which is you know the hugest, most influential newspaper throughout you know this, the south part of the state, uh, was run by uh, the Chandler family, and Chandler uh, was a member of one of the secret societies. It turns out that uh, uh, mm-hmm. Rachel or Ray, um, it's a woman, is right. a director and photographer, um, and uh, you know heir to the newspaper dynasty. Uh, she granted, graduated over there in Brentwood, in Hollywood. You get, listen, Gary. I don't know what's going on with your audio, but we gotta we gotta reconnect with you because this isn't working at all. Okay. Your, your audio is terrible. Can you? We need to connect you by phone rather than on a computer. Are you on a computer? Yeah, maybe we'll just have to go phone direct. On this Let's one. go to phone I don't, direct. I don't know what's okay, going I, on with I'm it. gonna have him call you right, right back. Okay, Tomas, call Gary back. Us, we're getting crunch crunch sounds, and we can he can get, get feedback. He's putting it through his computer. That's what the problem is, right, Gary? Yeah, let, yeah, that's good. Let's let's recall him back on the phone. I, I'm going to read off the letter. Furthermore, Ray or Rachel Chandler, as she's confusingly known, has been tied to numerous art events hosted by satanic spirit cooking pedophile and artist Mariani uh, Abramovich through the years, even working as a primary photographer for Terence Cole, K O H who is intrinsically tied to Abramovich through various collaborations, which has made satanic art and rituals with blood and semen, plus with exposed photographs of mock human sacrifices with cakes in the shapes of women, which are dissected at soirees attended by many elites and eaten, exemplifying human sacrifice. But it gets much worse. As when Pizzagate researchers, and by the way, uh, Miss Pelosi is involved with Pizzagate. This is a witch. Uh, Nancy Pelosi is a witch. She has con- direct connections to Pizzagate and pedophilia. Pizzagate, by the way, researchers discovered at at Ray Chandler's, which is their you know Facebook handler, now private Instagram account, and Tumblr page. They found that it featured disturbing images of children and sexually suggestive poses enough to make your stomach turn, right? And she actually, we have one of those pictures actually from her her page, her Tumblr page. This is one of the many disturbing images shared by Rachel Chandler on her Tumblr page. Ah, we got Gary back, and you're on the phone now, Gary, right? Yeah, testing one, two. Yeah, that's you're, you're perfect, okay. No more computer until we get a fancy headset, and then you have no feedback or whatever. She never thought uh, non-members would see these pictures. Why? Do they understand the Internet, the nature of the Internet? See, this is what's staring down. The, the, the Internet was created by, which is va, va, va. By the way, you know what you know what they talk about, www? It's actually a play on the Hebrew letter vav, which is the sixth letter in the Hebrew alphabet. So it's basically an occultic organization. And the organization that actually founded, including IBM Corporation, founded the Internet, was the intel agencies, including not only Five Eyes, but the NSA that's more funded than all the other intel agencies on the planet. So you have to understand that. Uh, so continue with Rachel Ray. And I, you, I got more documents here you said about Rachel Ray. People need to understand that all of your political leaders on the left and the right are in secret orders and are all Luciferic and Satanic. Even if they do some good works like, you know, the, uh, uh, what do they call them? They, uh, they go around on little scooters and they have the hat with a scimitar on them. The, uh, I don't know the scooter guys. <laughs> no. Yeah, the scooter guys. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. But my, my brain's trying to block it because it, it makes me go, oh, oh. Um, the, uh, anyway, you have to understand. If you don't know the nature of your world, you're going to suffer for it. When we come back now, we got good audio. We'll continue in the next segment. Explain this, and you'll have good audio, so I won't rant so much. You'll talk more. 
have difficulty taking supplements? Are you searching for a high-quality, complete nutritional drink that your whole family will love? Nutramedical's Life Support has arrived. All of your daily nutritional requirements in one quick, delicious drink. Dr. Bill Deagle's Life Support is a proprietary blend of vegan protein, activated vitamins, essential minerals, amino acids, probiotics, green tea, digestive enzymes, anti-inflammatories, cancer prevention, detoxification, and much more. Your body will high-five you for this one. Life Support is the best complete nutritious meal replacement on the market. Whether you are an elite athlete, have post-operative challenges, chronic illness, elderly, or a family that just wants a quick, delicious drink, try Dr. Bill Deagle's Life Support for optimized nutrition in one great-tasting smoothie. Just add cold water, almond milk, fruit, or anything else you like. Nutramedical's Life Support. Try our great-tasting chocolate or vanilla today. Call 888-212-8871 or visit us online at Nutramedical.com. Nutramedical.com for the whole family. Red Deer Velvet DR is an amazing new product with a patent to preserve 300 biomolecules and six hormones, same as fetal life, where you don't age at all. The state of fetal life allows the 300 biomolecules and six hormones produced by the placenta to be supportive of the regeneration uh, of tissues and organs with maximum apoptosis uh, changing the tissue and organ structure of a fetus. That's why if fetal surgery is performed, there is no scar. Taking uh, two to three capsules twice a day with oncomycin, myco D2, uh, provides an amazing support for regeneration of any tissue and organ in the body and even advanced stem cell therapy support treatment. Do uh, get Nutramedical's Red Deer Velvet DR from Dr. Bill Deagle at Nutramedical.com, NUTRIMedical.com, 888-212-8871. Stay well and stay young with Nutramedical. Lumen Photon Therapy, infrared light, far and near infrared, is extremely important for pain control, simulation of nitric oxide, improved perfusion, and stem cell activation and reduction of cytokines. Dr. Bill uses it for pain control, for regeneration techniques, for organ regeneration, and for stimulation of your stem cell activity. Uh, this amazing uh, Lumen Photon Therapy this year will probably have an additional device with frequency therapy during the on phase of the lights. To obtain a Lumen Photon machine, contact Dr. Bill at Nutramedical.com, 888-212-8871. He'll prescribe it with you, providing nutraceuticals to help with your regeneration, healing, and pain control. Nothing like the Lumen Photon Therapy for uh, easy therapy for your eyes, your pain, your joints, regeneration of organs, detoxification of the body. Get a Lumen Photon machine from Dr. Bill Deagle, Nutramedical.com, 888-212-8871. You stay well with Nutramedical. The Sonic Life Machine is one of the most amazing therapies that Dr. Bell provides. It is the best sine wave exercise machine on the planet, doing whole body vibration, opening up the muscle to reduce insulin resistance, improve perfusion, release stem cell therapy throughout the body, and epigenetically stimulate the body to release DNA activated. Uh, the epigenetic therapy with the uh, sine wave curve of frequencies given for atomic resonance by Linus Pauling for minerals and amino acids stimulates the production of messenger RNA to correct structural protein enzyme deficiency for almost every illness. There's nothing like the sine wave therapy for improving body healing for exercise, but also the epigenetic treatments Dr. Bell can provide can help neutralize frequencies for disease states and illness. Get a Sonic Life machine through Dr. Bill Deagle at Nutramedical.com. Contact us at Nutramedical.com, 888-212-8871, or go to the website Nutramedical and give us a contact. Dr. Bill is available to help you get well with Nutramedical. Need a powerful ally to fight daily bugs and serious pathogens? Allison Med is the powerful universal pathogen killer's latest advance of German-sourced Allison, enzymatically stabilized to clear the body of bacteria, fungi, mycobacteria, and parasites. It penetrates body biofilms and is non-toxic to tissues. Pathogen resistance cannot develop for long-term body-optimized wellness. Clear stealth pathogens that promote autoimmune disease, cancer, and vascular inflammation and plaque and promote healing of tissues. Now pathogen-free. With 200 milligrams more power than prior Alamed, you can't get a more powerful ally to fight daily bugs and serious pathogens. Give your body what it needs. Allison Med. Order Dr. Bill Deagle's Nutridyne at 888-212-8871 or Nutramedical.com. That's 1-888-212-8871 or Nutramedical.com. And listen to the Nutramedical Report on the Genesis Radio Network with open lines every weekday. Nutramedical.com, bringing nutrition and medicine together. 
headset and nice microphone. But we're with Gary Rich Journal because we want to connect the dots. These people, and you mentioned three of them now, are involved in the pedophile organization. And that includes, by the way, this idiot, this Adam Schiff, which I've changed the last two letters of the name from F to T, because that's what he's full of. This poppy-eyed, blank-faced moron uh, lies and then has the nerve to continue lying as if it's perfectly true because he says it's true when you have an audio clip proving he's not. So why are we doing this? It's because you have to understand the nature of the evil behind these maniacs. They're not just mentally ill. They're spiritually indwelt. Please continue. Yeah, and, and again, consider the person that's in charge of the Intelligence Committee, that Pelosi would appoint him and these other people that are receiving money from Ed Buck, uh, you know, the, the guy involved in the, the satanic, well, you know, murder of uh, young gays and children and, and teenagers and so forth. Right. I mean, this comes right out of the San Francisco. This is the same Jim Jones crowd uh, that existed before and that was covered up but it does turn out that the you know they they use filters like ed buck to uh finance the campaigns for you know a number of members on that particular committee uh the intelligence committee and that also includes members from secret societies right um it turns out that this uh the standard hotel which uh, uh has had a number of hollywood people there uh, is owned by a man by the name of Andre Balaz. And I encourage people to look this up. Even Wikipedia hasn't stamped out all the information about uh, about some of these people. And I'll spell his last name twice so you get a pen. I'll spell it in a minute. But um, he's, uh, he belongs to a secret society from uh, Cornell. And again, in Wikipedia, it's after you look his name up and look right. up... Uh, uh, Quill and Dagger, you'll see that it isn't involved in intelligence. Yeah, but you said it quickly, uh, meaning Quill, Q U I L, like pen, like a bridge, yeah, like, like old a pen, style. Quill and Dagger. Pen, Quill, and da- Quill and Dagger, yeah. And that it has, uh, you know, had people coming out of their society as uh, national security advisors, heads of the World Bank, like uh, Paul Wolfowitz and Stephen Hadley, um, chairman of Standard Oil, uh, uh, Phillips. Uh, Union Carbide, the big uh, chemical monopoly. I mean, these aren't lightweights. And um, this Andre, B-A-L-A-Z-S, Bala, B-A-L-A-Z-S, Balaz, I guess, Andre Balaz, uh, belongs to Quill and Dagger. And uh, if you go to Quill and Dagger, you'll find that they're connected with the Knights Templar, and they you know brag about a whole lot of things. But it's very powerful very wealthy as you know chairman of standard oil and the other companies i've already mentioned so these are no lightweights that uh, uh, we're having to deal with and it's no wonder that uh, you know the local little republican and uh, democratic central committees uh, are, are uh, they're so they're they're not even puppets i mean you go up to you have to go up to the u.s senate and the uh, congressman and uh, chairman uh, like Schiff before it particularly matters. The rest of them are, are so insignificant. But uh, you can tell that they have the full support of the lying press. As I mentioned, the L.A. Times, the most powerful and influential paper, we've got uh, a Chandler that's involved in uh, you know procuring and doing uh, photography. She's got uh, you know connections with... Uh, uh, Epstein and uh, and the Standard Hotel um, right. and no, 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 uh, Rachel no, Handler. I now, by the way, these people are connected familiar. to Buck, but Buck is connected to Adam Schiff. And Schiff, by the way, yeah. I found out this weekend uh, he was connected also to uh, Ukrainians because this, this Ukrainian guy actually actually he raised money for him in his last run, I think, in 2015. Uh, Schiff is is a very dirty guy. So was. Nancy Pelosi. So is Mr. Nadler. I've changed his name to Rattler because he's like a rattlesnake. <laughs> what you have to understand is what's going on here. And and do you think these background things are important? It gives you some kind of like cred to see exactly why they're so bizarre and how they're so consistently bizarre. They don't stop lying or they can't even keep track of their lies. They just get more and more 
I'm telling you the truth, even though you got video clips that prove they're lying. It's mind-boggling. Oh, and yeah. No, it's, it, it's so phony, and that's why it, it, it's so obvious that the uh, Republicans are, are manip manipulated also. The, the, the timeline, mm -hmm. I mean, the, fir the supposedly uh, uh, the first complaint was way back in August 12th, and, uh, yeah, and uh, Schiff said that on, on the 28th that he was holding it up, and then on September 9th, he's asking for, for transcripts. And, and on the 16th, he says he doesn't know what's in it, when actually he was the one that helped craft the complaint that was submitted way back in August 12th. Well, that to me is a coup. It's not, see, this is not a whistleblower. This is a spy. And Schiff is a master, along with the other maniacs, of a coup. There should be a DOJ investigation, and Schiff and his other cohorts should go to prison. This is a prisonable event. And in fact, in many previous societies like Britain or early America, he'd be executed. But I think yeah. he should get life in prison. As I mentioned on September 16th, he said he didn't know what was in it. And on September 17th, he said he had not spoken directly uh, uh, to the subject. And he was yeah, but he, he, sat down But even one subject. of his own staff came through the media and said that. that he did have contact, he's a liar. Exactly. But uh, anyway, it's, uh, it, it, it's, out, it, it's outrageous how, what, what's right. being played on the people, and they're, they're just being lied to. Yeah, well, I, don't, I don't want this happening anymore. I don't want to see Trump suffering anymore. Trump's a tough guy, obviously, and he's able to hold his own. But I think if he starts a DOJ investigation, if he actually, McCarthy is actually trying to get, uh, you know, uh, Schiff, removed as the investigator of this so-called investigation. Have an open vote. Then a minority in the House actually get to have, to have a chance to subpoena. If they start subpoenaing, they're going to pull everything up right back to Hillary Clinton and her phony emails and getting off with Comey. This is going to well, get... Remember exactly. on this very show, six or seven weeks ago, we went into the Biden uh, uh, business, both in uh, communist China and in, in the Ukraine. We also mentioned right. uh, Mitch McConnell and a few others. So we've been you know, way ahead of this, this curve. And I think, again, this uh, Andre Belas uh, is incredible. There's pictures of him oh, standing alongside Abram Abramvik, uh, the lady that does... Uh, uh, spiritual cooking, uh, yeah. supposedly with uh, yeah, uh, well, liquid have, from the body. <laughs> didn't they have Podesta um, there with this ceremony of death? And they had a guy laying in a coffin here a few years ago, and it showed them doing this this ceremony of death with the guy's laying in a coffin. He's not dead, but they're eating fruit, and it actually is human blood that's mixed and and with food. You eat on one of these satanic ceremonies where world leaders go and. And had this guy laying in a coffin acting as a proxy dead person with a satanic ritual, and he's got all his mask on and facial mask like he's a dead person. This is disgusting. It needs to stop. And these are our political leaders? No. You need to be in a psychiatric ward and have a first-class exorcist try to deal with a demonic entity in them because they're not normal humans, are they? Nope. Here I found a uh, publication from a New York Times, uh, November 9th, 2017. Says this Andre Balas is known as the standard brand, uh, cre is the creator of the standard brand of hotels that he created two decades ago. He, he had been dating Uma Thurman uh, as well as uh, Chelsea Handler. Um, so uh, you know, it, it's right into the heart of of Hollywood, and. Uh, I think I think there's stuff on shift. I mean, if this really cracks open, we keep hearing it's going to. Uh, frankly, what we have right now should uh, should be open. They're just trying to uh, sew it back together as fast as they can. But um, there were three people, three owners of the Standard Hotel that went down in a helicopter. And I think you called the Adam Schiff Hotel in your uh, document here, and you got the hyperlink to Reddit. So uh, Adam Schiff. Is directly connected to West Hollywood and the Standard Hotel. Please continue. Right, and this is pretty much like uh, what uh, you know Podesta and Panetta did with uh, 
uh, Ron Brown. You know, they, <laughs> it seems like airplanes are a convenient way. I, I know uh, Larry McDonald, one of the congressmen, uh, leading congressmen, went down in that 007, in which was uh, sent down into the uh, into a shooting gallery, basically. I don't know if you've got the picture here with uh, Tony Podesta and Bill Clinton and George Nader and a few other people all uh, uh, naked up, well, uh, naked down to the water, uh, all palling around with each other. But again, we've got the Podesta, which goes directly to Pizzagate. It goes directly to Leon Panetta, who uh, Podesta was his right-hand man as chief of state uh, for Bill Clinton, who visited Lolita Island 26 times and Hillary some six times. So it's it's all there. And then when you go to Epstein's uh, little black book, uh, we've, we've got the, you know, We've got the connection with Andre Balaz, who comes from these very, very wealthy and powerful people. Um, and, you know, they recruit uh, children and kids from, from Hollywood. I think there's been uh, uh, exposés uh, coming out from that exactly. for, for a long, long time. And I think one of Anthony's friends... Uh, the FBI, uh, Ted Gunderson, had been working on, you know, a lot of that uh, 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 trafficking and exposés. I don't know. If, I don't think he ever put it into a final book. Unfortunately, he had mostly uh, papers that were stapled together. But he he was on it, and he was. Uh, um, but the problem is, I you got, see, there's there's several ways of approaching evil. Uh, when you're leading with transgalactic evil, and I'm, I'm just gonna, for the sake of we're not putting out actual numbers, but let's say. Let's assume that the demonic horde that are indwelling our world leaders are, say, a million years old. And they're from another world and they're very intelligent. And then we're dealing with Satan. It is the most intelligent created being in history. Now, God's infinite, so the devil can't compare. But if you think that you can match your EQ, IQ up with transdimensional and exoplanetary beings that are, think it's a game to avatar our world leaders and play games with the population of Earth. Just look at the agenda of the Green Agenda. And all of these demon rats, including Yang, all of them support the idea of population reduction, changes the biosphere like Project Scopex. I got introduced it at the United Nations in 1997 with Dr. Isley, who was the head of the World Constitution Parliament Association. He's a physicist who had owned the Vitamin College, and I met him in Colorado Springs, and when we shared that I had all my security clearances, he did a data dump and gave me the Federation of Earth's documents. People need to understand, no one knows more about the overall picture and the background of this, and it's in God's hands, that he put me through this hell, than me. And if you disrespect me, you take away grace. And there's nothing more vile, in fact, in the Bible, it says in the Bible, it's more vile more evil, because you can't sin against man. Man is, you can't sin against man or even the environment. You can do evil against it, but you can't sin. The word sin means you did something that's not accepted by God's will. By definition, therefore, it's evil. And when you disrespect someone who has knowledge that will save you physically and spiritually, it's worse than mass murder or even abortion. And that means I'm a man of spittle. I get a lot of disrespect from co-hosts and other networks, from other networks, from the relatives, friends, whatever, call people call themselves friends, backstabbing friends, medical professional groups. And what I want people to understand is I'm not doing this as a party. I'm doing this because I'm concerned that America, like 60 years ago when I got the vision as a little boy up in heaven, is heading toward a thermonuclear annihilation of America. Now, we finally got a breakthrough when I prophesied over a month ago on the exact day, I said we would receive a response from Trump on the 12th of September. But what's going on here, Gary is actually laying out that these people that were dealing like Adam Schiff and Nadler and so on, these people are Satanists. Get it, okay? They're not just bad or weird people or political operatives. They're driven by the power of Satan, right? That's right. Well, West Hollywood was incorporated as America's first gay city. And Are you still looking for that one iodine that you can really trust? A medical doctor endorsed product that is backed by honest research and true integrative science. Then search no further. 
Go to NutraMedical.com for Dr. Bill Deagle's Nutriodine, proven time and time again to be the very best iodine available for you. Nutriodine is the only Tesla-activated monatomic plasma iodine in the world. It optimizes mitochondrial function and generation of new mitochondria from totally neutralizing the venom from a desert recluse spider bite in Southern California to eliminating malaria parasites reported by medical missionaries in Central India. Dr. Bill's Nutriodine is simply the most powerful healing formula there is. Nutriodine clears the body of all known pathogens, restores it to an alkaline state, and even promotes stem cell regeneration. Order Dr. Bill's Nutriodine today at 888 8871 or visit us online at Nutramedical.com. Red Deer Velvet DR is an amazing new product with a patent to preserve 300 biomolecules and six hormones, same as fetal life where you don't age at all. The state of fetal life allows the 300 biomolecules and six hormones produced by the placenta to be supportive of the regeneration uh, of tissues and organs with maximum apoptosis uh, changing the tissue and organ structure of a fetus. That's why if fetal surgery is performed, there is no scar. Taking uh, two to three capsules twice a day with oncomycin, myco D2, uh, provides an amazing support for regeneration of any tissue and organ in the body and even advanced stem cell therapy support treatment. Do uh, get Nutramedical's Red Deer Velvet DR from Dr. Bill Deagle at Nutramedical.com, NUTRIMedical.com, 888-212-8871. Stay well and stay young with Nutramedical. Hi, I'm Dr. Bill Deagle, MD, AAEM, ACAM, A4M of Nutramedical.com and a consultant providing email advice free on advanced protocols for your optimized wellness and advanced technologies to heal and regenerate you. You can contact us at NutraMedical.com, that's N-U-T-R-I-Medical.com, or 888-212-8871. You get free email starter protocols of our top medical-grade nutraceuticals, initial testing and the recommendations for your own primary doctor to do, as well as recommendations to give you an idea of a consultation and a full protocol to try to help you regenerate your tissues, heal naturally without the use of toxic polypharmacy. I can send test kits to you as well anywhere in the world and provide you recommendations for referral of specialty clinics worldwide. So contact me, Dr. Bill Deagle, at Nutramedical.com. That's N-U-T-R-I-Medical.com or 888-212-8871. At Nutramedical.com, we have the most amazing drinks with the best most feel, highest quality bionutrient uh, exposure to your body to heal and regenerate, and the uh, most powerful persistence of nutrients to heal your body dramatically. We have Ageless, which makes you age less, which repairs your DNA, extends your telomeres, etc. We have Life Support that detoxes Phase 2 detox pathways, glucuronidation, sulfation, and methylation pathway support. We have glycemics that blocks the carbohydrate absorption, helps with diabetes or weight loss, and as well helps with people that are trying to build up muscle using things like our um, special formulas from Dr. Wolf called Mega Muscles Between Meals along with Sports Energy Light. We have the amazing Nutri Complete, the most complete red and green drink in the world with the best mouth feel and flavor. You can often mix it too with Vitamin Mineral Mix, which is our fruit flavored mixed power of vitamins. Stay well with Nutramedical every day. I remember when, I remember, I remember when I lost my mind. And welcome back. We have uh, Gary here. Gary, um, we've been very laborious in going through this. And the reason is that what's happening right now is the satanic ceremonies through the demon rats. But there's also bad guys in the Republicans. There's a lot of rhino Republicans quitting before the midterm election, before the next elections. I want uh, Trump supporters, but I also want to get through to Trump. If you and I and our other cohorts, I call our Samuel Council, like John W. Spring, could get a half an hour every week with Donald Trump, because he's an insomniac like I am, and we could talk to the maniac and get him up to speed, he would have a better menu of things to choose from. No, he doesn't have to believe us. I don't want anybody to believe us. In fact, I tell people, do not believe Deagle or anybody else I have on the show, unless you do three things. Number one, Ask better questions and research. And then when you pray, and do pray, ask the urim and thumb stones of God's spirit inside you to tell you if it's true or not. And if it is, don't ignore it and think, well, I'm just going to turn the other way, and I think Deagle's a nut. So if I attack Deagle, 
I don't have to actually do anything. Then you need to take action if you think it's true. The fact is we're dealing with a world that's ready to pop. We're on the edge of an economic bubble. We're on the edge of a thermonuclear and ecological catastrophe. And if you actually draw it all out like Star Wars, we are being terraformed, like Mike Adams says on this Gen 6 conference, we are being terraformed by transdimensional and exoplanetary evil to destroy the human race and the biology of Earth for non-humans. Now, if you don't believe me, tough. It's going to happen anyway. I am not going to set dates, but I'm going to tell you God's going to put an end to it. And he's going to start the rapture. So when I hear fools push the rapture, shut up. There's no such thing as a rapture, except to remove evil from the earth so the earth becomes a reasonable place to live for regular normal people that are godly. What's going on right now is we're heading forward a catastrophe, and the thing that God will use primarily will be earth changes like a pole shift. No more internet, coastal tsunamis, major superquakes all over the world for two months. That'll put a stop to them, and if you're prepped up and you're okay, you'll be fine. If you're not prepped up, those two minutes will be the end of your last uh, few weeks of life. And what's going on on Earth right now is our politicians, the mask is off, isn't it? They're not trying to hide it. I mean, I even see a kind of like a tour now by Hillary Clinton trying to explain why she lost the 2016 election. This woman, you're not listening to a woman, you're listening to a 16-foot-8 Draco reptilian speaking English to the mouths of this woman like she's some kind of a toy or pet of this beast inside her. That's what's going on. You're not listening to a rational or even a normal irrational human. You're dealing with a human avatar by a transgalactic evil that you cannot ordinarily conceive. Please continue, Gary. Yeah, well, this is, again, a, a harder tie. I was mentioned the Los Angeles papers owned by Otis Chandler and uh, Anna's son, and one of those belonging to a secret society. And then her offspring, uh, she's uh, named Rachel Ray, but on her pictures that she puts out, uh, she credits him to Ray, taking the man's, you know, a man's name rather than Rachel. And uh, some of the pictures in this expose I've got here on uh, the uh, Adam Schiff Standard Hotel is a picture of uh, Epstein's satanic table, uh, temple on Lolita Island. And she had, a, she had this picture on her Instagram, and it was picked up by Pizzagate researchers. But, uh, and it says it shows uh, naked people sitting at tables. Um, and uh, there's a part of that picture together with the temple on Epstein's uh, Lolita Island. And again, this ties right into the Clintons to uh, this Andre Balaz. Uh, again, he's huge in this deep-rooted uh, quill and dagger secret society. Um, I think this is going to be, uh, I think it's as big a root uh, uh, for the deep state is skull and bones after I look at the at the power behind this, this group. It also, as I already previously mentioned, it includes National Security, World Bank, uh, the owners of Standard Oil, Conoco, and uh, huge chemical companies. These guys are incredibly powerful. And Epstein, and they're, they're mixed, they're churned together with the uh, Congressional Intelligence Committee with Adam Schiff. That's why he's fighting for all his life uh, to uh, recapture and to get rid of Trump because this information is getting out in bits and pieces like uh, what we're doing here, and more and more people are, are finding it. Even, even It's taken me time to, to put together uh, a lot of this information that's being released. But do please support a uh, broadcast like this and, and purchase the books and do some of your own research and uh, you know, prove the story. Show up. You know, one of the best ways to support us? Get all your nutraceutical and your consultative needs from Nutramedical. If you don't support us, we won't be on air. Number two, then take out that pro se litigant course, how to win in court and start filing lawsuits against these secret orders, against your politicians and corporations that are trying to force vaccinate. I got a panic call last week by one of my doctors here in California that they're starting to delicense any doctor who gave a vaccine exemption. How many vaccines do you think they have in the pipeline for teens and adults now? on top of the children. 300. 
They even have a vaccine against the N-methyl aspartate receptor that makes you lose a God reflex or a need for a higher power. They want to modify your brain. They want to hack into your consciousness. They want to know where you are to a cubic meter. They want to know whatever you buy, not just on Amazon. They want to Amazon you right down to where you're living in cyberspace. And there's a movie about 20 years ago now almost where it's called Coma, where people will decide to actually just go into cyberspace and hang on wires and they can live in cyberspace for hundreds of years while their body is kept in life extension. Now, if you think this is a foolishness and it can't be done, smart people like me, and I'm luckily I'm not evil, smart people like me that do evil things can invent this technology and they're working on it. They're only a couple of years away from having it completed. I would have had it done years ago. Thank God I didn't go to work for these son of bitches. The fact is, if you think we're making this up, you're going to die. You're going to be a victim of what's called the Darwin effect, which means if you don't get out of the big tire on the highway and you're a little squirrel, you're going to be squashed squirrel. Okay? And the fact is, you're not going to get this information from Alex Jones or Coast to Coast Radio or any other network, even Rents, he's going to entertain you. Rents doesn't even have his own personal opinion. I mean, I, I couldn't believe it when I hear it from Alex Jones or even I'm trying to get on the program Mike Adams. Mike Adams, I know, had a valid, you know, pretty good presentation there. But you understand where's the source of information? What are his medical qualifications? He's pushing lots of nutraceuticals. I don't see any. He's not an MD. And he's got a battalion of attorney of, of writers writing for him and developing these nutraceuticals because they have to have a platform to pretend and take over the and control stories. The fact well, that a lot of people for there. for good reason have uh, you know put a lot let, of this blame on finish, the East Coast and the Ivy me, League. But let they me have to remember first. that, let me that California, first, let me with its first. Bohemian Grove and its L.A. Times and its yeah, Gary, UCLA let me and first. its Hoover Institute. Let, let me finish. Uh, Alex Jones and Mike Adams are CIA. Most of the, so there's three groups in the alternative media. There's real people like you and me, and we are a handful. Then there's the people that are master controllers that are supported by these intel agencies, and they're in secret orders. And they produce anywhere from, say, 25 to 50, 60 percent truth, and the rest of it is blather, so they can control you. And then finally, there's mentally ill, narcissistic people who just aren't talented and they're boring. But there are the, the vast majority of well funded people in this organization of alternative media are either government intels or secret orders that are trying to control the narrative of the story, like Alex Jones and Mike Adams. And if Mike came on my show, I'd say, look, I, he says he's a Christian. I'd say, okay, do you connect uh, God to these transdimensional entities? Do you know that the Vatican is pushing a thesis that these aliens can actually evangelize us because they know more spiritually advanced stuff than humans? How far can these SOBs go in the Vatican? This is not a pope. He's not even a Christian. He doesn't even qualify to be a decent human, let alone a Christian. I mean, long before you become a Christian... You should be a decent human first to qualify, to give over yourself and your will to the Creator God. But people will think, oh, well, Dr. Digger, you're just making it up. No, you can his own words actually say this. So please continue. Okay, it's, it's a, I was mentioning, you know, a lot of <laughs> a lot of we people out west have always, you know, we're looking back to New York and Del places like Delaware because they all of trillions of corporations they they pound out of there but um so much of this is rooted in in the west and it comes from very early on when the harriman brothers and the railroads uh, southern pacific came out here when daniel coit gilman was the third president of the university of uh, california daniel coit gilman incorporated skull and bones um, uh, very uh, dangerous and evil and of course we've got the coit tower daniel coit uh, but uh and, and again, we've got uh, uh, areas like Ojai uh, that uh, are the you know, created the futurist uh, uh, communities like New Harmony back east when they were when the uh, Republican Party was first formed out of one of the fifty uh, communes that was uh, uh, set up by Horace Greeley and uh, uh, the uh, revolutionaries that fled. Uh, Europe after uh, all the revolutions in 1848, and uh, in fact, Lincoln hired a number of those generals, and a couple of generals uh, ended up on the on the southern side. Uh, that came from 
uh, you know, the Illuminati uh, revolutions in France and Austria and in other places across Europe. So uh, these people with this grand idea of uh, their self-importance and their uh, being God on earth and uh, that uh, people and children and uh, women or boys are all available to them by their so-called divine right, uh, have existed for a long time. You look at the origins of Bohemian Grove. It, has, it, it just, just didn't come alive when we discovered or found, found out about it. The skull and Bones has been out there since 1832. So uh, General Grant appointed a Skull and Bones Alfonso Taft to head the Department of War, uh, you know, right after Lincoln died. So uh, we're we're not walking into something that's uh, uh, not been out there for a while. So you, we have to be a little bit smart and understand that uh, you got to do a little ducking and dodging and 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 checking things uh, for yourself. But they're not invincible, and the fact is that there's more information out about them than there ever has been, and they are they are panicked because they can't stand uh, the light of day, and that's why this program uh, will be very valuable, and uh, it's up to you to expand it, take bits and pieces, and uh, share it with your neighbors, get it to people who reach people, whether it's a history And file uh, proselytic and actions. Get that course at the bottom of my shop by. Start filing actions. Sue the uh, the uh, United Nations organizations like the the uh, you know the, what they call them ICLE. People don't understand the insurance carriers are deinsuring people that their homes are burned out. Remember, I had my military friends up in Northern California. There were so many drones in the air, setting up fires in Northern California that they couldn't even get helicopters in to drop the fire retardants. If you think this just happened naturally, you're an idiot. Okay, it didn't. Okay, and when they, they when they tell you what they're up to, there's always a twist. For example, they'll say they got a name, a website with my name on it. Almost, it sounds like it. Deagle, D-E-A-G-E-L, not L-E, dot com, and it says we're going to reduce the population in America by 2025, 83 percent. That means they want to kill you. They're not just going to give you a nice hotel room somewhere on a beach. They're going to kill you. Now, they're not well, even building yeah. these so-called resilient FDR cities. They're not building them even. They're full of it. They, they, FDR they said if it happens in politics, you can bet it was planned that way. And, of course, right. we have their uh, their link over us with their uh, three-pointed spear with the Georgia Guidestone Protocols. And uh, right. that's why the forced vaccinations and the compromise of our yeah. health and so forth, which gives them uh, all the more reason to go to your website. Let's so. put it this way. I am in the next few months going to release a non-lethal technology you can build yourself that's much more dangerous than anything DARP or the military has. And if I think that they're actually going to start doing rounding people up for civil detention camps or execution, I'm going to release the bad stuff. Let me tell you, the devil himself shakes when he hears Deagle's name. If you think you aren't fearful, that's because you're not informed. And the dark side doesn't want the truth to come out there because these are Satanists. Adam Shit, S H I T T. Uh, Rattler, this rattlesnake there in this committee with uh, Nancy Palauzi. It's amazing.